Hello and welcome to a brand new video today and in today's video the topic of discussion is the future of the SSX series. Now as you can see from the gameplay on the screen this is SSX from 2012. This is taken on the Xbox 360 uh, via its backwards compatible through Xbox One. Now it did only release on the Xbox and PlayStation 3. It never released on Nintendo's platforms or the PC. Now if you go all the way back to when SSX Tricky was released, that was the pinnacle of the series, um, in my opinion anyway. Now SSX 3 was good, uh, you had on tour which wasn't as good, and then we had the bringing back the franchise idea of, of this one for 2012. Now you fast forward six years later, we're in 2018, and I've had a look online because there is a few petitions on like change.org, but there's not really that many. Um, supporters of it for, for them to bring back SSX as a series. Now what I could see as a potential idea because if you've, you've seen the news recently um, a lot of people have been leaking out that apparently there's going to be a Burnout Paradise remaster. Now EA is not generally one for making remastered games. Now if they are going to do it and they bring out Burnout Paradise then I'd be looking at potential to see an SSX Tricky remastered. Now I don't think we'd we'd go with the SSX 2012 version and do anything with that because yeah you could probably up the well up the graphics and the ante of it, but it I just don't think it would really change things because the game does look pretty good for what it is as it as it is at the moment. Now SSX Tricky could do with a big makeover and a re-release in fully HD remaster it into 4K and, and so on and it'd be fantastic it was one of the best games of the PlayStation 2 and original Xbox era um, that's just in my opinion anyway but I'd like to know what you guys think about this and whether you would like to see um, an SSX tricky remake and whether it would come out on the likes of Nintendo Switch uh, PC, Xbox One and PS4. I know personally for myself I would probably buy it either on the Xbox One or the PlayStation 4 however I'd always be open to the the prospect to buying it on the PC because I love SSX and it's one of the best series games that I've, I've played overall ever. Um, now what? how is it going to work, how is it going to be remade and, and so on that's the issue now because I think if they're gonna do it EA would turn around and say well you're using Frostbite now yeah Frostbite's great and Frostbite's been used in quite a few games but other than the Battlefield series for it to be used in the games have always tended to flop now you look at the Need for Speed uh, series you look at uh, there's just a few anyway Need for Speed and there's a few others but them games have all basically just flopped. Hardline wasn't really a battlefield game if you, you put it anywhere. But they just didn't sell well and they didn't do very good on the Frostbite engine. Now there's only really FIFA that's got anywhere, but that's FIFA. FIFA always sells anyway. And that's just how it goes. But this to me, I don't want to see a sex using the Frostbite engine. Personally, I could see SSX being sold off as a franchise. Um, you could see it poss possibly going to likes like Ubisoft. Now I know they've done Steep, which that looked visually stunning and was a really good game. However, it wasn't over the top and this is what they could do with in their sort of games. But let me know what you guys think about it, whether it should stay with EA or whether somebody else should buy the SSX series and take it from there. But thank you very much for watching, take care and peace.